Hello, I'm trying to come up with ways to further improve the output of my antenna. As you remember, this 440 foot loop antenna put out 15 volts DC. Warning, the following activity is extremely dangerous and could electrocute you. You do not try this unless you know what you are doing. Seriously, this could be like getting hit by lightning. I was thinking, install a ground rod at the base of each pole. and hook a diode to the antenna in the ground rod, and it would charge the antenna with whatever voltage was in the ground. I was also thinking put a voltage multiplier circuit on the antenna and ground rod, and then hook it back to the antenna so it charges it that way. So that way I could pull energy out of the ground and the air at the same time, and then dump it all onto one wire. Making a bigger antenna was not an option, but adding things to the antenna is. I'm thinking I could get major voltage differences from this pole to that corner up there. We could actually be talking thousands to millions of volts at times. Here are some of the circuit ideas that I have. First circuit, ground rod at the base of each pole and diode connected to ground rod and the antenna. Here I have some 1N34As. I don't think those are going to be powerful enough. Here I have some 1KV diodes. And here I have what I think will work the best is my 20KV diodes. Next circuit is a bit of a tank circuit. I was just messing with diodes, capacitors, and inductors here. This is pretty much a tuning circuit design. And here I have the most promising circuit. Now we have voltage multipliers connected to ground, the antenna, and back to the antenna. This part would be at the pole, and this would be the rest of the antenna here, so this would be much longer than it appears on this diagram. So it's pretty much identical to the RF to DC converter, except I have it at multiple places along the antenna, charging it at each pole. Well, thanks for watching. Please subscribe and happy experimenting.